All right, guys, welcome back to another video. Um, I'm the face behind DH Baits. I'm the one that's been painting all the lures. Uh, today is gonna be a little bit kind of, kind of a little bit of a different video. Um, I'm gonna show you guys how to make a musky tackle box that's like the Lakewood tackle boxes, but for significantly less money. Uh, this is gonna be a lot cheaper alternative route. It's kind of like a DIY Lakewood box. So all you guys are going to need is some PVC downspout pipe for a house, a hacksaw, a tape measure, something to mark it with, and then you're going to go to Walmart and you're going to buy yourself one of these soft-sided coolers. It's important to have these soft-sided coolers. You've got to have the hard shell on the inside. So you can go to Walmart and get one of these coolers for about $30. And then you can go to Home Depot or Lowe's or wherever you choose and go get some PVC downspout pipe for pretty cheap, less than $10. So all together, you're looking at $35, $40 case, which is essentially a DIY liquid box for about a third of the price or less. So all, I'm gonna, all you're gonna do to make this box is you're gonna use your tape measure and you're gonna wanna measure the depth, which I've already done, of the inside of the box. So you know how long to cut each of these sections of PVC pipe. So this one, in this case, is 10 and a quarter, and I've already marked these out. Uh, as you can see, these black dots, I've already marked these out, and then all I need to do is cut them. So I'll get to cutting with a hacksaw, and I'll speed through that, and I'll get back to you guys when I'm done and show you how to put together the entire box. Okay, so I got pieces cut here, and now all I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna shave off some of the bird edges here with a knife and trim it up a little bit so it's not making a mess in the tackle box. But before I do that, I'd like to take a minute to thank Barlow's Tackle, who I've recently become affiliated with to help support the channel. Barlow's Tackle is where I get all of my musky hooks from, as well as some of the baits that I use to paint for videos for you guys. They have lots of cool stuff, anywhere from musky lures to bass lures to lure making jigs, anything that you can ever imagine. So make sure you check out the link down below and check out Barlow's Tackle. I do get a commission off of any sales that are gone through there, which I use to help provide you guys with new content like this. Any sales that you guys buy through Barlow's Tackle under my link down in the description below really helps support out the channel. So make sure you go down below and check out Barlow's Tackle. So now let's get right back into trimming these up. Okay, so I got these all cleaned up, and to save you guys the time, I'm just gonna put what I have in the cooler and show you how to do it. So you just stack these in here like this. So it'll keep your musky base nice and organized in here, similar to a Lakewood box, you know. It's got the front zipper, you can put some terminal tackle in there if you want, it's got a nice strap that you can carry it with and all for less than forty dollars so if you guys like this video and thought it was helpful make sure to subscribe to the channel give it a thumbs up um, hit the notification bell so you can see when i post new videos uh, and like i said before make sure to go down below and hit the link and check out barlow's tackle 
that have great tackle and you won't be disappointed. So I hope you guys found this helpful and we'll see you guys in the next one.